Today, rumors are swirling around the sale of the Prince George Cougars. The team has been a staple of the local hockey scene since it moved here from Victoria 20 years ago. But while the team is denying the latest report of a sale, it seems like it's only a matter of time before ownership changes. The Cougars have a day off, and now it's the team's ownership that's having to block the shots. The Prince George Citizen is reporting the Cougars have been sold to a group of investors, including NHL players and Cougars alumni, Dan Hamhuis and Eric Brewer. But according to a statement from team vice president Brandy Brodsky, the team has not been sold and she won't be speaking to the rumors. But from the number of people in the stands, it's clear ticket sales are low. We've not made a secret of the fact that it's been difficult losing money over the last few years and uh, I think we've also been pretty open about if there was ever an offer that came across my desk or my dad's desk we would you know look at it and see but I can tell you that there have been no offers that have been made the team is not moving anywhere nothing's going on. These rumors are nothing new. We've said for a long time that we're tired of losing money I guess and I think people are aware of that obviously you can look in the stands and sort of see what's going on this year so people are maybe putting it together that you know if there's a, an, an opportunity. So. Owner Rick Brodsky first brought the Cougars here to Prince George in 1994. Back then they had a loyal fan following. But lately ticket sales have been way down. And that means the city of Prince George also takes a hit. This season the Cougars have had an average of less than 1,700 people in the stands at every home game. Given the price of an adult ticket is $18, the team has made close to a million dollars so far this season. The city takes a cut of ticket sales. The higher the team's ticket revenue, the bigger the take. This season, the city is likely getting around 5%. Prince George fans remember when the team was a hot ticket in town. They just don't have as good of players. Dan Hamhuis was good. Hometown boy, kind of. It, I think it would be a great thing if, uh, if they got sold to especially uh, some uh, Prince George businessmen. Because they suck. <laughs> According to the Cougars, the team isn't going anywhere, but that may change. I guess if... if um, something serious came across our desk, would we look at it? We always said that we would, so, um, but there, like I said, there hasn't been anything that's, that's happened like that. So as ownership tries to put an end to the rumours, the players keep their focus on the game. Camille McDonald, CKPG News.